Several people were arrested during cordon and search operations and house raids conducted by Indian troops and dreaded agencies in different areas of Indian illegally occupied Jammu and Kashmir. Over a dozen youth were rounded up in Srinagar, Badgam, Baramulla, Jammu, Rajori, Punch and Katwa districts. The troops continued house raids on the second consecutive day today in Uri and Baramulla towns, while similar operations were also carried out in Peer Panjal area of Jammu region. The sleuths of India's National Investigation Agency along with personnel of police and paramilitary Central Reserve Police Force raided four places in Srinagar and five in southern Kashmir's Pulwama district, subjecting the residents to harassment. All parties, Hurriyat conference leaders and activists in their separate statements in Srinagar deplored that the people of Kashmir have been living in dire situation created by the presence of more than one million Indian troops. They said rights abuses in the occupied territory have witnessed an unprecedented spike since the abrogation of special status of Kashmir by Modi-led fascist Indian regime in August 2019. The High Court of Occupied Jammu and Kashmir has asked Indian police to vacate a piece of land under its occupation since 2003 in South Kashmir's Islamabad district and pay compensation to the owner. It is worth mentioning here that at present Indian Army is illegally occupying tens of thousands of canals of land in Indian illegally occupied Jammu and Kashmir. An elderly man was crushed to death after being hit by a train near Pansgam, Bij Bihara section in South Kashmir's Pulwama district. Body of a 34-year-old man was found in Srinagar. The man, Shameen Ali Nath of Chhatarbal area of Srinagar, had been missing for the last two weeks. Two non-local laborers were injured in a mysterious blast in South Kashmir's Pulwama district today. The injured were identified as Mohammad Ishtiaq and Ranjit Kumar Ram, both residents of the Indian state of Bihar. In India, police have arrested four Muslim men for allegedly offering prayers at the Lucknow's newly opened Lulu Mall in Uttar Pradesh.